I went to the Olympics, I came home with a medal. It's the thing I've been working for my whole life. And then unexpectedly, everything I had changed. For the last two years, I was stuck in Russia because I didn't have any partners and any possibility to continue my skating career. Though separated by over 6,000 kilometers, Dylan Moscovich and Lubov Ilyushakina found themselves facing the same career crisis. Lubov had split up with her Russian skating partner in 2012. Dylan's five-year partnership with Kirsten Moore Towers ended shortly after the Sochi Olympics. Luba, that was perfect. That was yeah, perfect. Luba and I are both very driven people. That's, you know, a big part of who we are. I think we both feel like we had unfinished business in the sport. We hadn't fully realized our potential. I just want to, uh, to show the people what I can do. Dylan contacted Lubov and suggested they get together for a tryout. Our first day we did a really nice throw double and she landed it while she, while she was landing. She was like, tasty, smells like triple. <laughs> and instantly I like almost fell on the ice laughing. This is hilarious. You wanna race me again? When they do something well, you can just really get the sense of excitement between the two. Especially with that much experience in their age, it's like they're, they're fresh. Was it tasty? Luboff was granted a Canadian visa to train with Dylan, but there was a complication because before they could compete together for Canada, she needed her release from the Russian Skating Federation. We got a lot of mixed messages and we didn't know how long it would take, if it would happen, and it was a lot of back and forth, a bit of a roller coaster ride emotionally, training every day hard and not knowing what would come next for us. In October, the release finally came. The time was different in Canada and in Russia, so that, that happened earlier. And as I woke up, I had a message. I was like on the sky about, of, my, of my happiness. <laughs> it is clear these two enjoy being together. But until Luboff becomes a permanent resident, she won't receive the same funding as a Canadian skater. Dylan's personal savings are bridging the gap. He supports me in everything. I cannot find something where, what he didn't do for me. He can find a key to my mind to <laughs> put me in the right track. I really feel Luba and I have something to offer the sport. I think, you know, we have the ability to push the sport in, in certain directions. To hear her be so happy as well is, is nice. It, it's rewarding to know that what I'm doing is worthwhile and it's still fulfilling.